you guys. I hope you're doing, um, swell. So I was scrolling through my Pinterest the other day, as you can see here, and I was loving every single thing that Pinterest had for dorm decor. But then I saw the price tag and I was like, oh heck nah, we can totally do this ourselves. Everybody, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Katie for all you guys that are new here I have such an awesome video planned for you guys today I'm so pumped about it because we're going to be doing do-it-yourself dorm decor And I have been looking all over the internet for cheap and cute inexpensive items for my dorm But everything is just so expensive and I do not want to spend a ton of money on a bunch of decorations That I can easily make myself make sure you stay to the end because I'll show you some of the things that I bought for my dorm as well Let's get crafty. Okay, so so for the first thing that we're going to be trying to attempt to make is a cute aesthetic looking hanging plant and so I got this pack of four glasses from Family Dollar and it was only like four bucks for this whole box. I got four of these glasses and then I got these like vines and stuff from Hobby Lobby. I also got this big roll of like twine from Hobby Lobby too. So we're gonna take this glass and we're gonna wrap this twine all the way around it using my hot glue gun. Hopefully it turns out okay. <laughs> all done hot gluing a twine all over the glass I think it turned out really cute all I did for the bottom was just hot glue a piece on the bottom hot glued the sides and then I tied a little knot on the top and it's not completely like straight or anything but I'm just gonna wait to see how I hang it up in my dorm room so that way I can either make this string longer or shorter or just put it however I want but as of right now it turned out really good it's time to add some decorative plants and vines Okay, so I officially added the vines into it and I think it looks so darn cute. Just add them however you want, but then I kind of put this one a little bit longer and then this one a little bit shorter. Here's the final product. Hi, I'm back. <sighs> mm, so good. So for the next thing that we're gonna make, we're going to try to make this cute winky face pillow that I've seen all over Pinterest and Urban Outfitters. It is so adorable, but I don't know how it's gonna go because I'm gonna have to freehand the pillow drawing myself with a Sharpie. So it might not go as planned, but we're gonna give it our best shot and hopefully it goes good. So let's get at it. First of all, I'm just gonna show you guys what I got. So I got this pillowcase. It's just a regular white pillowcase from, where did I get this? I got it at Walmart and it's actually really nice because it has a zipper right here. So my plan is to cut it into a square and then do the winky face drawing with the Sharpie marker and put cardboard underneath so it doesn't bleed through. And then after I'm done with that, I'm going to stuff it with this fiber fill. I also got this at Walmart. So I'm going to stuff it and then after I'm done with that, I'm either going to sew it, which I know not everyone has a sewing machine and not everyone knows how to sew, but I'm going to sew it. And if you don't know how to sew, you can easily just like hot glue the edges back together and you will be golden. Let's get to cutting.
just got done sewing the edge off. So this is what it looks like. It looks a little homemade, but honestly, I think it turned out really good considering that I just free-handed it. I traced it out with a pencil first, but as you saw in the video, it was kind of a struggle and I was erasing and I was just, didn't know what I was doing, but it turned out pretty good. So now here comes the fun part. We get to stuff it. So this is what the final product looks like. The last DIY craft project that I did, a line art picture frame, and I've seen these a lot on Urban Outfitters and Pinterest as well. All of the stuff I've seen on Urban <coughs> Outfitters Basic. and Pinterest. Here's a clip of a line art portrait, and these just look so aesthetically pleasing, and I hope to like hang mine up either in my room or on my desk. The way I made this was I just got this eight and a half by 11 picture frame at Walmart, and then I'm going to be going online to Google. I just typed in line art, pick whatever, which one that suits best, and I printed printed it out and it should fit in this picture frame. So this is the final product of the line art portrait. I think this is super cute and aesthetic looking. I can't wait to like hang this up somewhere in my dorm room or just like prop it up against my desk or something. It's super easy to do. Just print off a picture, put it in a frame and we're good. Another DIY craft that I did, but I did it a while ago, so I don't have like any film on it or anything, but I still wanted to show you guys because it's such a cool craft. It's actually a babe cave sign, and I've seen these all over Pinterest, and I saw it off another website that I was looking for dorm decor off of, and they were all like pretty spendy, so I'm super glad that I made this myself. So this is just what it looks like. It just says babe's cave on it. And I made it with my Cricut actually, so it's just like cuts out letters. And this is vinyl, it's like a stick on vinyl, so you stick it on, lay it on, peel off the transfer tape. But you can always use a paint marker or use stencils or just freehand it yourself. And then for the white trim, I used painter's tape and then just painted it white. I got this piece of wood just lying around our farm and just in a shed. That was free so, so I made this very inexpensively. I just got from a hardware store and then I just tied knots in it so it's kind of of a beachy boho vibe. I think this is gonna look so cute in my dorm room. I can't wait. So for the next thing that I have for you guys is not any DIY. These are just decorations that I have bought, but I thought I would just throw them into the video because why not? We're already here, we're already watching dorm decor, so I thought I would just throw it in here. I got this cute little flower thing from from Hobby Lobby, it was actually on sale for like four bucks. Another thing that I got, I got this from the dollar store for like two dollars. It was actually on sale, not for eight, but for two dollars. And it's just like this cute little gold mirror. So it has a mirror right here, and then it has little hooks hanging. And I'm thinking that I'm gonna put this above my desk at college and hang like necklaces or keys from it or something. I think these and this flower would look so good paired together. That was just another two other little things that were really cheap that I just found at the dollar store. And that is all I have for you guys today. I really hope you enjoyed watching this video. Hope you guys get around to recreating some of these items because I think they look so cute. And make sure you like and subscribe down below so you don't miss any of my future videos because I'm sure I'm going to be coming out with a dorm room tour very soon and I would not want you guys to miss it. I will see you guys next week. Bye guys.